I have all of these notebooks of mine with all content ideas that I could do videos on. Um, but I'm not going to use it today. I'm just going to wing it. Hola Camigos, I am back again with another video. Yeah, I'm just going to wing it. I just didn't have a plan. I, d I don't know honestly why I am even in front of a camera. It's crazy how life is so short. And when something like a tragedy or something that's amazing and good news and bad news. Okay, let me start over. <laughs> this is what happens when I wing a video, guys. Whenever there is triumph and tragedy, you tend to look back on your own life and wonder what I'm doing, where am I trying to get in life, what is my goal, and then you make changes because if something so drastic happens in your life, as much as, you know, someone getting engaged, someone getting married, someone having a kid, or someone passing. Sorry guys, I am doing natural lighting again, so that's my bad. And I just noticed that with everything that's happening around me, it evolves what my future or what I want my future to look like. I was recently asked about my stance on children again, and I made videos on marriage and children and my stance on it so long ago, and I think it's almost the same to be honest. I I'm at an age where I really do need to not be on the fence about having kids because if I want to have kids, the time would be coming up. <laughs> it's not really a subject here, I'm just rambling, but at the end of the day, it's crazy how something so tragic or something so sudden can automatically evolve your life without you even thinking about it because when I found out that my brother and his girlfriend were having a kid I was so happy oh my god like I'm still happy like oh my god but it also lets me take a step back and makes me you know wonder my life choices as well as makes it also that oh blah, blah, blah. it also makes it makes me want to strive for more because that's going to be my niece or nephew and I want to provide as much as possible because I'm going to be an aunt. And then with people sudden passing, not only recently but from years past, it really puts into perspective what life really is about and how short it is and unexpected and unpredictable it is. You can be here one moment and then the next moment you're gone. It's just scary to think about and it should push you to want to do more with your life, whether that be contribute to the community or go after that goal that you've been doing. If you want to do something overseas, do it. I say do it because what do you have to lose? And yeah, I, I don't know. I'm feeling some type of way, I guess, and I just this is my way of like my outlet and I just feel that as much as possible I want to tell people not to waste any time any day you know like god there's a plane out there and it's so annoying you guys hear it yeah I always reiterate to everyone that I've hung out with that you know make the most of your life because you just don't know when your time is up as morbid as it sounds but to be honest you can't save everything for later, you know? What if later never comes? So ultimately what I am just like thinking and rambling on about is that I I just can't believe that people just go, you know? And it's crazy to me, it's just crazy. I know they always say live life to the fullest, but then they also say, you know, save for a rainy day. and. To be honest, living life to the fullest isn't traveling, isn't traveling all over the world, it isn't going skydiving, it isn't climbing a mountain. Living life to the fullest is just making every day something that you'd be proud of. And I know I'm not like old, but I'm not young. I, in my head, feel like I'm old, but I'm coming up 30. I feel like there's so much I want to accomplish and I think what I'm trying to say is if you have a second, if you're second guessing yourself on certain things, don't. Do what your heart says even if it's something, you know, totally out of your character sometimes. Oh. Uh oh. Okay buddy. If 
you've been wanting to tell someone how you feel, do it. If you've been wanting to change something in your life but have been so scared to. Because it really is unpredictable, man. It's nuts. It's, it's so wild. Oh my gosh. I'm going on a tangent, but I don't care because this is how my mind works. And I wanted to let you guys in on this craziness that is my head. I just want to put it out there that, you know, life is unpredictable. Don't always expect to be here tomorrow because sometimes, someday your day will be up where you're not. And you just got to live, man. Like, man. Ah, all right. Sorry guys, my memory card was full so I had to reload a new one. So I think where I was cut off was where I was saying that, you know, I know this might be boring to you, but this is my channel and this is me. This is life, I guess. I do love my subscribers and I love all my thrifting people and I will continue to thrift, don't worry, but I like to insert different videos here and there that shows that I'm something more than just the thrifting queen. <laughs> I guess I'm just gonna sign off, not regularly, because I mean, yeah, yeah, just live life to the fullest, but be careful, and yeah, just make your life worth something to talk about at the end of the day.